We're back in Abuja, where Justice Binta Yako of the Federal High Court has threatened to adjourn indefinitely the trial of the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra in Amdekano until his defense team is ready for trial. Tiva Senior Senior Reporter Celestina Iria was there. In Namdikano, through his counsel, Aloe Ejimako requested the court to restore the bill earlier granted him in 2017 by the same court and judge. In his submission, contrary to the claim of the federal government, he did not jump bail or breach any conditions of the bill, but had to escape out of the country when the military allegedly invaded his house. He asked the court to set aside the arrest warrant issued against him by the court while he was out of the country. In a separate motion, Mr. Kano demanded his removal from the custody of the DSS and to be placed with house arrest or, on the alternative, to be remanded in prison custody. Counsel to the federal government, Adigwe Igawomolo, opposed granted of all the requests made by Mr. Kano. Among others, the senior lawyer said that in a criminal matter, no defendant has the right to dictate to the court how his prosecution will be conducted. On the request for removal from DSS custody, the counsel to the federal government held the only safe and secret environment for Mr. Kanu is the DSS facility in a bid to ensure the safety of his life. We have not had any opportunity. We have made this very clear. It is not about having access to our client. We do have access, but our access is monitored, hampered to the point that we are unable to discuss with him within this, that zone of confidentiality that is guaranteed between a lawyer and his client. I will continue to call on the president to exercise his constitutional power and then issue knowledge through the attorney general so that we can bring this thing to an end and open the door for reconciliation and peace building in this city. Fair trial is predicated on confidentiality. Now that I don't have confidence, I don't have any confidentiality with my client. How do you want him to? How do you want me to enter to uh, to take him on trial? It is against the rules of professional ethics for a lawyer to commence a trial with a client that you never prepared. Justice Binta Anyanku says since the commencement of Namdekanu's trial in 2015, she has delivered nothing less than 21 rulings on various applications. And on 20th May 2024, she will yet again deliver another ruling. This ruling will determine how Namdekanu and his defense team will proceed with the trial. Celestina Iria, TVC News, Abuja.